When you guys are ready. I'm ready when you two are. Ready. Okay. All right. This morning at approximately 2.37 a.m., the Marathon County Sheriff's Office was asked to respond to a residence in the town of Elderon. Initial reports were that a gentleman had been stabbed in the face and that uh, also during a scuffle that occurred, he fired his handgun. Initially, he didn't believe that anything had happened to the person that, uh, that he was in an altercation with, but that person ran out of the house with the gentleman's handgun. The gentleman who was stabbed was 79 years old, and the person that stabbed him and left with the handgun was 22 years old. When deputies arrived on scene, they found the 22-year-old deceased in a car with a gunshot wound to the chest. At this time, we do not believe that there is any danger to the community. Um, we have detectives on scene and are actively investigating the scene right now. So, uh, how many are out there at the scene right now? How long do you expect the investigation to go? Right now, all we have are detectives on scene. Our patrol deputies have cleared for the most part, other than I believe one for scene security. Our detectives will be there for the better part of the day processing the scene, and, because each time these happen, we treat them as a, as a major crime scene. So then, uh, can't give us the specific address or anything like that at this time yet? No, we can't provide that right now. Right now we're in the preliminary stages of the investigation. And as we learn more and get the, the timeline and the details uh, lined up, we will make sure that we provide you with that information. And at this time, you don't know, are they related, housemates, anything like that? No, we don't believe that there's any relation at this time. Um, the gentleman that was stabbed in the face, I should add, did receive medical treatment and is recovering. His, his wounds are non-life-threatening. And he's the one that initially fired the weapon, is that correct? Yes. Okay. So he was coming back to his home. Um, he was assaulted and during the, the altercation was stabbed in the face. He's the one who produced the firearm. The gun went off. He didn't believe anyone was hurt. And then um, that the attacker left with the gun and the gentleman that was stabbed in the face called us. So that's kind of to clear it up and sure. make sure that it's clear for you. And then we found the 22 year old deceased in the vehicle at the scene. Do you know that you knew each other at all? We don't, that's, it's preliminary right now. So we, at this time we don't, we don't believe so, but we're working on that. So home invasion situation, all that's on the table right now? It is. Okay. Until both, we learn more. Were both weapons recovered in the vehicle? Uh, both weapons were recovered. Okay. Any other questions? That's all I got. <laughs>